Hey yo, hello everybody, it's me Nick the Brick, and today I am back with another video. And if you haven't noticed for past few hours, there's been an image floating around of two new ninja suits for the new Ninjago season, that being Light and Kai. And what we see is pretty cool, I mean it could have been better, because those two suits seem pretty generic for me, but I still think they are cool enough. You know, I think Light might be a little too bland, and while while Kai has a lot of gold, it's kinda unbalanced on him. So I'm not sure how to feel on those suits yet. Of course, we'll need to get more images in the future, but in this video, I'll be showing you how to make those suits using official LEGO pieces. Now, let's get straight into it. So for Kai, I actually used legs from his scuba suit. I mean, I don't think it's really perfect usage of the legs, but there aren't really any better legs you can use for this one, at least as long as it goes for Kai minifigures, because those legs are red, but they also have some gold details, and we definitely haven't gotten legs that would look very similar to that yet, so I had to improvise, of course. Then for the torso, I also had to improvise, as you can see here. So I flipped Island Kai's torso around and then I gave it the gold arms and that I think actually fits pretty well. I think that was actually a pretty creative thing I did here. And then for the season um for the top of the figure we have season 11 armor piece in gold. And of course we have the Ninjago movie Kai face as well as the legacy golden mask for Kai which also looks really really awesome. And also about the official figure, this one will actually have a really different symbol on the top of its mask, because in the Valbrin seasons, Kai had always a Ninjago symbol which represented letter K on his mask, and now this letter will turn to red. I don't know what's up with that, because Lloyd actually has the same symbol on his mask, so I don't see why they changed it on Kai. I mean, I get that he's red, but why would you put letter R on his mask? I don't exactly get it, but yeah, we'll have to wait and see. For the Lloyd right here, I actually decided to use island legs from him. Even though those legs are kinda dark, they definitely have a little amount of gold, which I was looking for, for here. And the actual printing actually fits with the rest of the figure. But yeah, you can also use some lighter legs for sure, but I actually decided to go with those. Then for the torso, we have Lloyd's rebooted torso, obviously with the original dark green arms, which is exactly what we see with the new figure. I'm actually really surprised how similar the new torso looks to his rebooted one, which I think is really interesting. And then we also have Season 11 armor piece in gold, Ninjago movie Lloyd face, and the Season 11 Lloyd mask. So yeah, overall I think this suit is gonna be pretty cool. But it's mostly just his season 11 suit with a bit more gold and dark green, so I think it's a little too plain to actually introduce something new like this. But oh well, we'll just have to wait and see for more images as I said before. And all of this is gonna wrap up this video. Personally, I'm really glad that we are starting to get some leaks and images of the new stuff for the summer. I think it's just really, really cool. And yeah, I also hope we'll get the new season on track pretty soon. I mean, it's definitely been the longest period we haven't gotten a new Ninjago season between Seabound and the new season that we are gonna get. I mean, actually, even the gap between the rebooted and Legacy of the Green Ninja was a little shorter for my understanding, but yeah, we definitely need a new season and that's for sure. Also, be sure to let me know your thoughts on the suit and as well as those customs in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed this video, I would highly appreciate a like. Don't forget to click that subscribe button, you can ready. Have a great day. See ya.